The winner of the 2022 NAB AFOW Rising Star is Mimi Hill from the Carlton Football Club. Able to find Hill, told to go. A big second half here, and it's young Mim Hill, who might go straight towards Fessio. McKay, great attack, great run from Hill. Hill, with lots of green grass in front of her, makes the most of that open space with a couple of bounces. Sends it inside, 50. Okay, with another chance, and now Hill with the overlap. The plane, able to win the ball, and holding the ball, free kick, Hill. Covering the ground so well. That is an excellent kick. On track for another big game. Yeah, it's impressive the, the way she's playing and right on cue now. It's she's using the ball well, she's getting dangerous around contest. Mimi, congratulations. Carlton's second NAB Rising Star winner after Maddie Prasparkas. And an incredible honour for you. Can you believe you're standing here this evening after you returned from that knee injury? It's, this is crazy. Um, if you told me 12 months ago when I was sitting on the couch um, or hobbling around on crutches that I was going to be here, uh, I wouldn't believe you. Uh, my heart's racing so quickly. It's just crazy. Um, but yeah, this is... This is a dream, and the fact that I'm here is crazy, yeah. The professionalism and the dedication it must take to not only be able to come back from something so serious, but to hit such high standards. Did that experience make you cherish and love your footy so much more? Yeah, I think anyone who's gone through a serious knee injury or any long rehab injury knows how much you miss it when you're not on the field. So um, that was the fire that got me. Um, guests back out there, um, and I'm so happy to be back. You are part of a really fantastic youthful group at Carlton uh, under your coach Daniel Harford, and I imagine you must be so excited about what this group can build towards in the future. Yeah, it's a pretty fun group, um, and I'm so excited for what we've got going. I think we showed the competition near the end of the season um, what we could produce, and yeah, hopefully we can stay together and um, keep playing some good football. Now, I read that Cathy Freeman is one of your favourite athletes of all time and you love watching that Sydney Olympic run. It is obviously one of the most inspiring things in Australian sports history and then tonight you have the opportunity to inspire a new generation of young girls wanting to play football. Girls like little beautiful Poppy that presented yeah. you with that, that medal. How cool is that? It's pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie to you, I wasn't born when Cathy Freeman had <laughs> run that race. Um, but watching it on YouTube footage. was amazing. <laughs> um, yeah, Poppy, Poppy is a legend. And, um, it's so exciting, I think we can all agree. Um, when you go to the park or you go watch a local game of footy, seeing young girls run around is the most exciting thing. Um, so, yeah, to be, I don't know, inspiring, I guess, is cool. You certainly are inspiring and a hero to, to young girls wanting to grow up and do what you're doing. I'm sure there's some people you would like to thank. Yes. Uh, firstly, thank you to the Carlton Football Club. Um, the support you showed me over the past 12 months was amazing and I can't thank you enough. Um, you've changed me as a person. Um, thank you to my family and friends. I know I have to put a lot of time into footy, um, probably time that I'd spend with you, um, but I love footy, so that's what I need to do, but I love you guys more, so I hope you know that. Um, and thanks to mum and dad. Um, they're very passionate about women's footy, so that's, that's great. Um, dad, I look forward to um, looking at the Facebook post about me winning this award. That's going to be excellent. Um, <laughs> yeah, I think that's it. Thanks to NAB for funding um, grassroots footy. Um, we know how important it is to get kids involved in sport. I think I've thanked everyone. Well done, Mimi. Let's put your hands together for Mimi Hill, the rising star for season 2022.